in the mythology of the Andean civilizations of South America, the Amaru, Amaru, Quechua, or Katari, Aymara, is a mythical serpent or dragon, mostly associated with Tiwanaku and Inca empires. The Amaru is a huge double-headed serpent that dwells underground at the bottom of lakes and rivers. Illustrated with the heads of a bird and a puma, Amarus can be seen emerging from a central element in the center of a stepped mountain or pyramid motif in the gateway of the sun in Tiwanaku. When illustrated on religious vessels, the Amaru is often depicted with bird-like feet and wings so that it resembles a dragon. The Amaru is capable of transgressing boundaries to and from the spiritual realm of the subterranean world. Knowledge of this creature may have been brought to this region due to the association with Tiwanaku. Tiwa in Uru mythology, a pre-Incan people. Azaru is a protector of mines lakes and rivers. It is closely related to the Aryamara deity of An Chan Chu, a terrible demon who haunts caves, rivers and other isolated places. There are definite similarities between the Amaru and Inanna, also known as Anak. Amaru is also a Arab and Greek word. The French Polynesians had a similar figure within their mythology. The Anaku, who is a servant of death. Anaku appears as a man or skeleton, wearing a black robe and a large hat, which conceals his face. On occasion, he is simply a shadow. This would be the evolution of the Udug, the Utuku, moving north. In Sumeria, it would be Pazuzu, An Zu. In Egypt, it would be Shezmu, progressing to Tuhut. In Mesopotamia, it is a lion. In South America, it is a puma or panther. The scientific name for a lion is genus Panthera. Therefore, the lion can also be the panther. Knowledge of the Anaku may have been brought to these regions. Remember, we are looking at the Amaru of Tiwanaku, similar to the Malak. It is capable of transgressing boundaries.
Amaru. The meaning of Amar. There are three Incan laws from which we can derive the meaning. Amazua, fucking zoo. Amalulula and Amakuela, meaning don't steal, don't lie, and don't be lazy. Ama means don't. The root ru meaning war. Amaru means don't war. The official meaning of the name is sacred serpent or large serpent. If we were to remove the demon aspects, the name would be cognate with the Arabic and Greek meaning. Amaru is of Arabic origin, and means blessed with eternal life. The name Amaru, of Greek origin, has a similar meaning, a humanitarian, with an intense emotional power, who possesses strength and immortal love. That, my dear friends, would be the kryptonite to the Crimson Cape, meaning Hydra algae, found in the lakes and rivers, demonized by the word. Don't forget, the Anzu Crest belongs to the Basque population, which is high between two peaks in the Spanish mountains 